There you go. Ah, yeah. Okay. Today, uh, we are going to have a good day. Uh, I'm going to film the whole day. Uh, I've got my assistant Mags with me by popular demand. <laughs> and she's on giggling. Yeah, the camera. Yeah. <laughs> what we're going to do is make a concerted effort to cultivate positive emotions, right? Because I think if we just go about our day passively and hope that we have a sick day, we have a lot lower chance of actually fucking having one. And when I say positive emotions, I don't mean simply the hedonistic approach to pleasure, um, like immediate fucking feels and that. I mean, like a general broad spectrum, good for your soul type, uh, smorgasbord of feels. So I'll take it. And so we're gonna do a lot of like different shit. I'm gonna film it all, and we're just gonna try and like just generally have a sick one fucking day. And so I'll vlog it all, put the video together in a day, and uh, bang it up soon. Let's do it. some of Kayla it seems top tips eat about five to six small meals a day consume a meal high in protein within 30 minutes to an hour after your workout otherwise otherwise what like don't drink any soft drinks Try not to drink too much juice or eat too much fruit as fruit contains a lot of sugar. A lot of sugar. Try not to eat as many carbs at night. <laughs> Okay, the plan is we're gonna go make some uh, some knowledge gains, man. It's one of the uh, positive fields that we are cultivating today. So what we're gonna do is we're um, gonna go water stones. We're like pick up a book that we're interested in, just sit there and then steal about like 30 minutes worth of knowledge. Then we're gonna walk out, and not even fucking buy it, man. So what we do, we just steal knowledge. Take my hand and just let go And feel the world beneath us start to slow Yeah, I believe we're on to something real Something real Okay, 
somewhere I read something called The Organized Mind, which was decent, kind of interesting. I might actually buy it, but what I'm gonna do is go on Amazon and like see if I can get it for like a penny, like third hand or something, absolutely battered. Uh, also bought two books. Um, I saw these, the, in fact, I saw that one on uh, the Fight Media Critic channel. Uh, so I thought I'd read it because he seems to have good like book knowledge. Also, that's like uh, quite a well-known one, and I don't know. I just thought it was interesting. So what I'm gonna do is read them both pretty fucking fast, and then I'm gonna do book reviews. Okay, next up we're gonna go to the Tate Gallery uh, on the docks because I feel like seeing shit that kind of in inspires awe or shit that's like impressive. I feel like that's a. I feel like awe is a good emotion, man. I feel like that's a good. It's a good thing, isn't it? It's a good feel. That's what I'm gonna go feel. Okay, doing it. Okay, so we've done a bit of being cultured motherfuckers. Some cool shit in there, actually. So, uh, maybe we're gonna be an artist from now on. Don't know. Uh, we're gonna go eat here at Coat Bistro. Because uh, it's got a good eagle on it. And because it's like a lunch menu and that, so Mike's gonna buy me lunch. Two courses for 11 quid. Cheap date me. Okay, we're gonna eat some good, healthy fucking shit. All right, I'll show ya. Since. Cauliflower soup, peeps. And uh, some kind of cheeky little salad with another poached egg. Saying. Scenes, love poached eggs, us. Sea bream vibes, okay, we're doing it. Okay, we are doing a bit of nature. Because nature's good for you, man. Like, looking at like plants and like shit. You know, like stuff that's alive. I feel like it's good for you. Um, just like calming influence, isn't it? Also, I remember hearing about some like study that was done, or some maybe experiment kind of thing that was done, where there were two groups of people, um, and they were given some kind of test to gauge their creativity, and then they were sent out on walks and one group went through downtown whatever city it was it was quite a big some city in america had a walk through this city and another group went for a walk uh through some gardens and shit um just a generally oh that's a sick view man sick view yeah just like some nature and shit man and then they tested them again and the ones that walked through kind of a more countryside type setting um, improved their creativity like fucking loads basically whereas the other ones didn't and so we could deduce that experience in nature has a 
positive impact on our creativity. This view. Mag's looking moody, staring out. That's sun though, come here, look at this. Looks sick, doesn't it? So uh, the next feel on the menu is uh, gratitude because I feel that's a good one, isn't it? That's an, that's one of the one of the good ones, man. And like I heard people talking about it a lot, especially like, Tim Ferriss and that and uh, Alex Icon. And a lot of people actually, as part of their morning routine, list shit that they're actually like, grateful for. Uh, I might make that part of my routine, but for now. What we're gonna do is uh, the shit that we're grateful for. I'll tell you what, I'm, right, we'll do three things. You got three things in your mags? Mm. You can just do one if you want. Okay. Well, I'll just use many as a. You can use me as one. Okay. Uh, having curly hair. I think that's a good one, man. Yeah. Because when I was a kid, I used to hate it, and then I grew <laughs> up, and I think it's funny and good. Okay, what you got, mags? What part other than you? Yeah, other than me. Um. Our breakfast this morning. Breakfast this morning, that's a fucking good thing to be grateful mm -hmm. for, man. That's good. Um, I'll go again. Uh, being healthy, man. That's good. Mm -hmm. That's good. You can have that one as well. Yeah. Say so being healthy. Being healthy. And being healthy. Alright, so being we got loads healthy. anyway. The point is mm -hmm. that um, a lot of time you meet people who are like moany little cunts and like negative about shit all the time. I think these are people who forgot that they're actually alive, man. And like forgot what a fucking not miracle per se, but like they forgot how lucky they are to uh, be like a alive, b healthy, c attractive, d funny as fuck, five intelligent. And all the fucking rest, basically. And uh, life's decent, so we should say thanks. Even if it's not thanks to anyone. Just thanks for, like, you know, for being here and that, because uh, the chances of you being born, like, a tidy fucking guy in a Western country within 40 minutes of mags is dead slim. And you gotta be grateful for that shit. Boom! Doing it! Alright people, just the last mags, she's gone home now, so just me for the rest of the video. Um, I was going to do some emails and shit, but my laptop just decided to update without my consent on, so now I'm getting uh, Windows 10 forced upon me and got to kill some time, so I'm going to use this to go to the gym, train, uh, I'm, gonna do, I'm on pull today. Uh, I'm training on my own, so I haven't got anyone to film anything. I might film a couple of sets or something, but I'm not going to make a big thing out of it. It's just a standard pull workout. It's not really the um, main aim of the video. Uh, and that's it, really. A bit of machine fitness shit. If you want to get some, then that'll like help my G-Wagon fund. And then I'll make like, sick videos of a G-Wagon. I'll just like, drive around being like, I'm in a G-Wagon. I'll like, egg, egg people out the window and stuff. What are you messing? That's a waste of eggs. See you in a bit.
basically this is a this is concentration club. Tony Blend over there doing some uh, tat designs. Got him for edginess. Uh, I'm doing emails as well, I just finished my emails actually, and now I'm doing like Turbo Graft on um, WhatsApp Web, man. You should be getting on WhatsApp Web. Because it's sick. Because like you have all your combos there. I'm not gonna like show you because then you'll know like it'll blow me up and I'll be graft. <laughs> <laughs> but you have all your combos there and you can type like fucking obviously on your laptop and that so it's like well quicker. Okay, we're on work slash creativity hype, so going to edit together a video, basically. Spend some time doing this, maybe put like an hour into it or something. yesterday's video here um, yesterday was pretty much just a kind of trial run at structuring a day in a way that will be conducive to as many kind of good feels as possible I was trying to kind of um, you know just instigate some 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 fucking vibes man um, and I think I maybe bit off a little bit more than I could chew trying to fit such a variety of stuff into one day um, but obviously that's just because it was filmed over a day um, and you don't ever actually have to do that I suppose if you I suppose the definition of balance is accepting that you can't fit everything into one day and just spreading it across and you know dipping in and out of things like for example there's some shit that I missed out on that I would have liked to include um, I said to Mags in the morning, oh, we'll, we'll do something good for somebody, you know, we'll, we'll think of something and we'll, you know, practice some kind of generosity uh, just because I feel like that's something that is definitely gonna make you feel good, man. Even, like, aside from doing a good thing, you know, if you tell somebody to have a nice day, it doesn't just improve their chances of having one, it improves your chances, you know. Um, and I would have liked to have fit my meditation into that day and also uh, I didn't get a chance to do some mobility and stretching and stuff and I think that's quite a meditative act sometimes as well so sometimes you could probably do one or the other um, and I would have liked to have fit that in but we had to check out of that apartment and stuff and um, so yeah, there was stuff that I'd like to film, but overall, like, it was cool, man. It was a good little day, and I suppose it wasn't very fitness-based, but I feel like I've turned a fucking corner in the sense of uh, my motivation to just live a little bit differently than I have been living. Um, and I'm going to pretty much make another video now, um, which will be me analysing myself and my life and uh, making a plan basically and just have, uh, putting together some kind of conscious effort to just be a sick fucking guy man that's gonna be it so next video will be uh, it'll be Joe Delaney analysis and it'll be plans on uh, the rise so over and off for now guys hope you enjoyed it uh, subscribe to my channel buy all my shit send me seven quid and if you're a bird inbox me boom <laughs> Joey D wrapping things up. Hey. They see me rolling. They hating. Joey Lenny is my hero.